What's up guys and welcome back to the life of Kevin and today's episode is going to be the third and final episode where we're going to follow Emma through the detective career and I know that there's a lot of episodes that I could make on this but I think it starts to get repetitive after a while you do the same things over and over it just to keep advancing. And I set the goal out in the beginning where I want Emma to look like a detective. I want her to earn her that holster and like the uh, the badge on the hip and that kind of stuff rather than the meter maid outfit she's got on now. So I think this episode is going to be really interesting because we're going to get to solve our own case. We're going to get to make an arrest. We're going to get to interrogate people. It is going to be awesome. Is that is that Will Smith? I just showed up to work like it's 901. Oh my God, it is. I, s I still have my eye on him, you know, I don't trust what we found. We arrested somebody else last time, and I still think he's guilty. He's kind of, he's just sitting here, kind of eyeing the station, making sure nobody's on to him. Creepy bastard. So I'm pretty sure the first thing we need to do is issue an APB, like we did last episode. We're going to get a suspect, arrest them, bring them back here, and then we get to interrogate. And that's going to be enough to get our promotion for today. And then tomorrow, we're going to have to do something else to get another promotion. But I'm looking forward to actually figuring out who did this. Okay, how do we do it? Issue APB, there we go. Because last episode, this is the same crime. This is the crime where somebody broke into, um, oh, was it Jack Frost and Elsa Frost and Geralt of Rivia and Yennefer and broke all of their electronics and spray painted their floor and stuff. So we got a lot of evidence. We've added a lot of things. Look at our board. It's looking so good. We have lots of clues. So let's figure out now. Can we issue an APB? I'm really curious who it's going to be. If it can be somebody we know, I don't know yet. I hope it's Will Smith. The suspect is wearing jeans, has red hair, is ambitious, uh, is a young adult, is female, and is wearing a blouse. Wow, that is absolutely killer. So, jeans and a blouse with red hair, and is a girl. We have so many clues. We did an awesome job. Emma is killing it with this career. You know what? She's doing so much better than everybody else in, uh, in the, um, the precinct, I guess is what you would call it. Oh, what? Okay, this is... Hmm. Okay, let's uh, let's ask around. Let's um, ask about the suspect. I'm starting to think it is this girl that we asked. She's a young adult. She's got red hair. I guess those are jeans. They're just colored. I guess that's a blouse. I thought blouses had uh, had a button down front. Maybe we can um, introduce ourselves and then see if we can learn something about her. Because she's apparently ambitious. If we learn that she's ambitious, then it's definitely her. Well, Emma's been pressing her for information for a little while now. We know that she's a snob, and that she's unemployed, and all of these other things, but she hasn't given up that she's ambitious. And, like, the, the workday is kind of starting to run out now. We gotta get um, our inspections going. Is somebody bathing in the... Oh, I'm not even gonna ask. So I think she is gonna be our suspect. Don't let her go, Emma. No, she's running for it. Make the arrest. We're, we're gonna go for it. Oh yeah, you're coming with me! <laughs> it's such a good animation. Yes, interrogate! Is this, is this how you interrogate? Don't you need to go in a room and like sit down with her and stuff? We're just gonna do it out here on the sidewalk. Confess, damn it. No? Oh, she was just giving her a stern talking to. Get moving! <laughs> turn that light on, Emma. Can I make her turn the light on? No? Okay. Oh! Um... So, good cop, bad cop, evidence. Let's hit her with some evidence. Oh, we have so much evidence. Um, let's review the case file. I have no idea what we're supposed to do, how to successfully go about this. That's you right there. Yeah, there's a picture of you. How could you do it? Um, crime pictures? Yeah, we got lots. Oh, look at that. She's like a magician. There's some more. What do we got here? Yeah? Oh, you're looking pretty screwed. Hmm, indeed. I'm not sure how this is supposed to end. It's always the same animation. She's just gonna <laughs> whoosh, and then she lays out three things, and then you're gonna you're gonna take a look at all of these, and you're gonna feel real bad. You're gonna sweat about it. What do you think? Mm-hmm. Do you do you? Is there any point where you confess? Kevin is going to work. That's not what I need right now. Okay, let's try good cop. Oh, can we actually? Offer candy bar, pretend to check phone, promise tasty meal. You know what? Screw that. We're gonna be the bad cop, Emma. Let's um dangle handcuffs. You're gonna go away for a long time for this. I mean, they're mine, but I'll put them on you. I can make them disappear. Neeb. Neeb. Holy crap. 
<laughs> That's the thumbnail if I've ever seen one. Threaten with spiders? Okay, Emma. So, finally... Did you turn the light on? We are going to put spiders all over you. The suspect appears to be guilty. It's time to put this criminal behind bars. Yes, the spiders did it, Emma. So what do we get confession? Oh my god, this is actually working? Yeah, tell me what happened. I knew it! Way to go, Emma! I think we got her. Perfect. Yeah, case closed. Nice work. And that's one criminal off the streets. Unfortunately, crime never sleeps and we have another case waiting for you. Get the assignment from a computer and get back out there. And that's what I mean. It's to be the exact same thing over again. We would go to another crime scene. Stuff would be broken. We would collect evidence. We would um, issue an APB, arrest somebody, and then bring them back here. And I think that's the whole career. So we've seen everything now except for Emma with that holster. So we need to get that promotion. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Do you guys see this? Doppelganger Emma and Will Smith are in on it. They're leaving the police station together. Emma Yager, young adult, Will Smith, young adult. And then regular Emma is like over here doing something. I was trying to grind through the day so that we could uh, get our promotion. I was just going to jump to it. There's regular Emma. The plot thickens. I'm going to have to expand on this in a future episode because I have no idea what's going on, but I bet you anything Will Smith is behind it. Did somebody... What? I was waiting for the time to run out. I think somebody just started a fight with Emma. She was out on patrol. Somebody jumped her. What is going on? Who, who is this? Trevor Collins, you are going to get your ass handed to you, Trevor. Oh, he beat her! What? You are lucky my shift is about to end. I only have four minutes left, Trevor Collins, but you're on my hit list. You know what? I'm going to try to issue a citation right before this ends. Do it, Emma. Hit him with the citation for fighting you. You can't just... Aw, oh, damn it. So close. Emma has been promoted to detective. She will make an additional $14 an hour. She unlocks um, a bunch of other stuff. We're getting all of the stuff that we need to make our own prison, which now that I think about it, hmm, I'm, I'm getting ideas for a future episode, but we're not going to go there yet. No joke, it takes three teenagers to fix one broken sink. Two of them standing around and one of them actually fixing it. But I want to get Emma promoted once more again today. She's got, um, let me see here, Emma, go back. She solved one case, so that's what she needs to get promoted. She just needs to go back to work. And getting your performance up is super, super easy. So I think we'll do one more day. Maybe we could spend a little bit of time with the family first. I know people miss the family. People kind of miss Kevin. They've been saying, you know, it's cool following him around. But don't forget about Kevin. You know, he's the life of the story, even though he's at work right now. But, uh, but don't worry. I got a lot of things planned. I got things planned for Kevin specifically. And uh, he's going to get a new career. I will tell you guys that much, but I'm not going to spoil what it is. I can promise you it'll be something you guys have never seen before. So it is going to be really cool. But I'm not ready to get to that just yet. Are you serious? You've tried to fix this like six times. It's still... Oh, just replace it. Screw it. Now that I think about it, I don't know if we've seen Barbie's alien form when she is a teenager. I'm pretty sure we just aged her up and had her look like this. Maybe we should take a look at that. That's something new. Whoa, that is super different. How strange. What if you go talk to somebody now, I wonder? Like, if you talk to... Well, obviously, Dad knows you're an alien. What if you go talk to Tommy? What if you go brighten his day? Is he going to be like, You're not a people! Let's see. Are you going to freak out now, Tommy? Nope. No shits given whatsoever. That's good. You know, he understands. We are gonna... Actually, she looks very different. Like, even her body form is different. She's like, uh... She's a little bit pudgier, a little bit rounder. When she switches back to her disguise... It changes her body shape again? Yeah. That's really strange. I would have never thought that. I thought they would have the same body shape. It just changes her clothes and stuff like that. Very interesting. Oh, she's a C student. And Tommy's a C student. And Apple's a D student. Man. Our kids suck at school. Oh, oh, what do we got here? Kevin's decided to take up painting again. I was just fast forwarding for us to uh, to go to the next day of work and he's just kind of hanging out and uh, picking up his old passion, which is cool. I'm kind of curious what he's going to paint now. It used to be a lot of fun having him paint ridiculous things. We've kept a lot of the best ones, of course, you know, the pre-kids, um, pre I believe this was. 
220 and Kevin's worth 871. <laughs> That's where the real money is, Kevin. Painting yourself. Those washboard abs. What are, we, what are we painting here? Kind of a starry night? This looks kind of cool. Congratulations, Kevin just finished painting a masterpiece. What do you mean a masterpiece? Isn't that like rare and stuff? Uh, impressionist painting quality masterpiece. Oh, wait, whoa, hello. Yeah, that's actually worth like a ton of money and stuff. Way to go, Kevin, I didn't know you had it in you to paint masterpieces anymore. Well then, we're gonna have to put that on the wall somewhere. Put that on the fridge. Oh, look at the sleepy cat and stuff. Okay, where are we gonna put this? This needs to fit somewhere. What a keeper. Right there. Kevin's first masterpiece. Can we frame it? I think it said we could. Ah, screw it. You know what? Something else we haven't done in a little while. Whoa! What's gonna happen? She Emma needs to change into that first. And that's right. We're taking the rocket ship. <laughs> it's been such a long time. I remember, I, was it Tommy that was conceived in space? Somebody was. Oh, crap. Actually, I never thought about that. Is... Is space woohoo unsafe? I never thought about that. Be safe, we don't need any more kids. No, 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 no. This is not what I need right now. What? Oh no, Emma. Crap, crap. You better give her back to me unfertilized. This is, this is bullshit. This is so bullshit. I haven't been saving. I'm, I don't know what to do right now. I looked outside and she was out by the pool and there was a little weird light. I was about to do something with Barbie and then I looked over and she's gone. There's nothing I can do. Oh, I'm pretty sure only guys can get pregnant by aliens. I don't think women can get impregnated by aliens, which is weird, but <laughs> let's just hope for the best. I really don't need another kid right now. Tommy, clean the damn stove. Emma's home. How you feeling, Emma? Emma, how you feeling? Very uncomfortable. Okay, so she's only feeling a little uncomfortable. She's not dazed, which is different. You still got your physique looking good. So, Kevin's like, yeah, man, I can totally relate to that. Not okay. Okay, moment of truth. Emma gets out of bed. Are you feeling okay? Ooh. You're walking around. You're looking good. You still got your swagger. I think we're okay. I think I'm right in that only guys can get impregnated by the aliens. Girls just have a real bad time. <laughs> Alien abductions aside, we are finally back to work. Now, Emma, you only need to get... Um, I'm pretty sure you have everything done. Yeah, you have all the things. You just need to get your performance up. So, if we can get our performance up to max by just doing any task it asks for us. Okay, get a case assignment done. Then we should be able to get a promotion. So, let's see if we can get this done quickly. <laughs> Yes, finally! This actually took three days. I thought it would only take one day, but apparently you need to up it a couple of times. You can't go all the way. Uh, it was a lot more work than I thought it was, so I did a little montage, but it was so worth it. Emma's been promoted to senior detective, making $78 an hour. She also requires, um, oh, she unlocked the one-way mirror window. 
Cool. The attainer and new clothes. Okay, the new clothes are what we want. Show me, Emma. Yes! Look at that! I gotta pause. I don't want anything to happen. Oh, Emma, you look so much better! You got your belt and you got your holster and everything. You look like a real detective now instead of a lackey. Oh, you're gonna be running this place in no time. I love that all the kids are waiting for mom to come home after the promotion, being like, way to go, mom! But that's gonna be it for this episode of The Life of Kevin, guys, and I'm so happy that we actually got to take a look at the detective career, because the careers are a lot more fun than I thought they would be, at least the detective career was. I've heard that some of them are a little bit of a disappointment, some might be boring, so we might not do three episodes of somebody being a doctor or being a scientist, but the detective career was really cool, and I'm really happy that Emma now has a job. She always was kind of the one that would stay at home, everyone will go to school, everyone will go to work, and she just had her writing, she couldn't really do anything else, but now she actually has, like, a, a job that she's really good at, so that's great, and I'm really happy that the series is going this way. Thank you guys very much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. <laughs> Zubat! Perfect. So I think, yeah, E to carry on shoulder. Oh my god, yes! Oh, look at that! He's so cute! Oh my god!